loves an exciting hockey rivalry. What sort of competitor are you? Welcome to Gotta Love Connecticut Hockey. I'm Ashley Leach coming to you from Westminster School where today we're asking that question of the Simsbury Pee Wee A1s and the West Hartford Pee Wee A's. We're expecting a very cold winter and if you've never built your own backyard rink, this is the perfect year to start. Contact Save All Pools to get started with your ideas and don't forget to enter your creation at our fifth annual backyard <laughs> rink contest. These two rival teams are ready for some healthy competition, so let's go check them out. How competitive are you on the ice and why? Pretty competitive because I want to win. Winning's definitely a lot of fun. I want to win all the mini battles. You have to get out there, you got to pass, you got to do your best. I hate to lose and winning is a great feeling. You're both on different teams, but you have one thing in common and what's that? We're brother and sister. We're competitive at home. We will wrestle, we will like bet, <laughs> we would fight. It's just pride that we're basically battling each other for today. On a scale of one to 10, how competitive are you and do you have any good stories? I'm about an 11. like to compete at everything from sports to school to work to ping pong. I'll probably on an 11 on a scale of one to 10. But with the kids, we're really trying to find the right balance with competitiveness and sportsmanship. <laughs> I am here with Greg representing Simsbury and Charlie representing West Hartford for our Gotta Love Connecticut Hockey Trivia Contest sponsored by the Gaylord Center for Concussion Care. So, you know, we're talking sibling rivalry. It's a special type of competition and the NHL has a long history of famous siblings on the ice. So, how well do we know these famous athletes? Let's get started. All right, question number one. Canadian Phil Esposito was known for scoring goals, and his brother Tony, well, he was known for shootouts. So, although they competed on the ice, they later came together to find what NHL franchise? This is a tough one. You have option A, which is the Ottawa Senators, B, the Florida Panthers, C, Tampa Bay Lightning, or D, Winnipeg Jets. Both Charge Lee and Greg have chosen option C, Tampa Bay Lightning, which is correct. Do you think being competitive is important? If so, why or why not? Uh, yes, because you need to go out there, do your best. You just got to keep on trying, even if you're down a goal. Being competitive is just, it's, it's good life skills. So what, what happens in hockey will translate to school, will translate to the rest of their life. If you're competitive, it leads to scoring goals. You want to have that, all the energy you can have to go into a game. What's the most recent bet you guys had? Um, like who's going to win. Okay, and uh, what are the odds looking like? I'm probably going to win. Hailing from their family farm in Alberta, how many Sutter brothers have played in the NHL? You have option A, which is three, option B, which is four, option C, which is five, or option D, which is six. Charlie chose option D, which is six, and Greg chose option A, which was three. The correct answer is in fact option D, six. How do you stay competitive personally, but play as a team? I keep my head up and try to give my team options so they can go down and shoot and score. I put the team first and myself second. Always working hard. Not being the one-man show. If I pass, they score goals. We win. How do you keep your players competitive but also playing as a team? We work in lines, we work in tandem, we work in communication is really important. So it's about competing, it's about communication with each other and realizing that the next game's tomorrow. Okay, so if we just finish this game, we focus on what's in front of us tomorrow. There's always another game. They're starting to get to the age now where it's not just about individual skill development, but starting to kind of get the team aspect, work as a team, work together towards common goals. If you remember, today's trivia contest is sponsored by the Gaylord Center for Concussion Care, which is leading us up to our last question. Which of the four Stahl brothers suffered a concussion after being checked by his own brother in a 2011 game? Was it A, Eric, B, Mark, C, Jordan, or D, Jared? Greg went with option A, which was Eric, and Charlie went with option C, which is Do Jordan. The correct answer is actually B, Mark Stahl, but that's okay. So our final score today is two to one. Charlie, that makes you our winner of today's uh, Gaylord Hospital Trivia. So thank you guys both so much for playing. 
Do you ever compete with people outside of the rink? And if so, where? Yeah, with my brother and everywhere. I compete with a lot of people at school. A couple of days ago, it was for the last pop school at lunch. Knee hockey, actually. Nice. And we had a one-on-one -on -one tournament, and I won that. Mostly with my younger sister, Mary Jo. You know, skating races, and one time <laughs> we're going full speed. She falls, goes right into the boards with her chin, and she beat me by a chin that day. What do you think makes the other team so good that they're your rival? Probably because they're really fast-paced. They have JP's sister. They're always working hard, and whenever we play them, we always have a good game. How competitive are you guys going to be with each other today? Well, we're going to be really competitive, trying to score and trying to win. Let's show each other that we're better. <laughs> I'm not going easy. I'm treating this Sims Ray team the hardest I will play like I would any other team. Go to Connecticut Hockey! Go to Connecticut Hockey! We hope these Peewees will always keep their competitive edge. And don't forget to submit your entries to our December Photo of the Month contest by Friday, December 12th. And join us again because you just got to love Connecticut Hockey.